Okay guys, we're back for more franchise mode, the Toronto Maple Leafs, Road to the Cup. Can't we? We're going to go closer to the deadline. We're going to go right here, closer to the deadline, and see how it plays out with our team. We did assign Mike Fisher. I kind of saw he was available, and he's cheaper what he wanted before, so we assigned him. So we're going to put him on the team now. It might give us a little bit more depth on center. So let's kind of go to that. Let's see what I can put. It's only a one-year contract. Oh my God, he's like this guy is a beast, and look at that, look at this. Because he's this guy is only has five goals in 39 games, so <clears throat> I'm gonna see if he can develop a little bit more in the AHL. Let's see where's Mike Fisher. I think. Uh, Let's go to roster moves. We're gonna make move some, do some moves. So moves we're gonna do. We're gonna bring him down. He's a two way. We're gonna throw him back in the AHL. I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with these two. So that's the moves. Oh, he's gonna go on waivers. How old is he? Twenty-four. Wow. Let's just see what happens. That's the moves that we're gonna make, guys. So <clears throat> we're gonna do. We're gonna add Mike Fisher down to the fourth line. He's an ED all ED overall. Kind of gives a little more depth. He's an ED in one speed or in face offs. So I think that will kind of give us a little more depth right there. Let's go to here. We're going to. We're gonna go like that. We're gonna cut this guy off, and we're gonna put the Eden 85 overall. Let's see what he gets. Has now having angel experience now. <clears throat> see if he kind of gets explode a little bit more. So did we lose? I'm curious. Did we lose him on waivers? No, he placed on waivers. No way claimed them, I guess. So I guess he went right through waivers. No way picked them up. Okay. So we're just going to keep grinding this out. Let's see if that move of Mike Fisher coming to the team. Did it help us? So we're going to go closer to the draft now. Let's l let it grow. <laughs> let it roll. Let's see what happens. Okay. We have to get the chemistry up. So Mike Fisher is happy. Okay. Ah, nobody liked that. Damn. Nobody liked that. Uh, it's hard to figure out the the, the team morale, whatever. <coughs> so. Ooh. We can get Jason Spencer coming to our team. Given a prospect, a fourth round pick, a third round pick for Jason Spencer for the next two years. 3.9, 82 overall. That will kind of boost up our center. You know what I'm saying? Why not? Let's do it. We made a trade. So now, let's kind of kind of go to the roster and add Jason Spencer to our team. Now our team's kind of got a little more stockpiled. 
on forward, our center. So we're going to add Jesus Spanza to the roster. Now our team is looking pretty, pretty awesome, I guess. And he's 36, so he can retire. They can retire any time. And you're not really doing anything, so <clears throat> what we're going to do, we're going to add you to the roster right there, and then go to here, let's go, where is he, left winger, he doesn't have to wait, put in waivers, he's thrown down, that's what we'll do. They got HL and the lines, and we'll put them on the roster. This guy is in 84 overall, and he's still growing. That's kind of crazy. He's this guy grew pretty. Pretty much, he was like a 58. This guy, I don't think he grew. I'll go like this. We're gonna add him to the raster down here. <clears throat> We're making moves in the NHL team right now because. It's time to win the cup, boys. So we gave up a third round pick, but we're we're ready to win the. We want to kind of get closer to our goal. So let's see what happens. <clears throat> but Jason Spencer might give us that confidence boost with our team, and. More depth from top and bottom. I think it's working, boys. We're not doing that bad. A team lost seven games in the AHL. They only lost one seven games. <clears throat> Captain. Yes. No, what? You're doing a good job out there. Be happy. Oh my god. <coughs> now, Vegas, 5th, 5th, 7th, all thousand twenty, and a, from one of our top, they know he's ready to play in the NHL. No, we're not making that trade. We're not making that trade and we lost the last four games I think we lost the last four games there yeah, we did come on boys start winning games what really 39 years old Ah no, we're not. We're declining that because we don't want them. Four one six three six two three nothing. Okay, we lost that one. Come on, boys. You guys can do it. Why? I don't get it, buddy. <laughs> I'm trying to motivate you, but I guess it doesn't work. There we go. We won those games, boys. We won those games. <clears throat> okay. So we're beating <laughs> Buffalo Sabres now for first for our division. That's pretty good. We have to win our division, too, to make some coins for our GMs. But the moves that we're doing, we're doing it. We have two more wins on regulation. So even we tied in the end of the season, we still get more. The chance was a league when down to seventh, so we have to win some games. But the only team on more regulations is Edmonton, so it's not bad. We're still catching up to them. We're not far, 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 far behind. 
Mitch Miner is leading the team in points, but our team is stockpiled right now. It's actually pretty awesome. He's still growing. Like, he's pretty much there. Goals. Who's leading the goals? Austin Matthews. Let's look at goal tanning. And now goal tanning is kind of rolling. That's who's leading the league in goal tanning wins. 31 wins. <clears throat> really? Wow. This kid. Where did this guy come from? Put him in that and bam. He won the games. Wins in 29 games. Price is not doing that bad. King Henrik is still playing at 37 years old. And he's still winning games. What about rookies? 18 goals. It's not bad. 33 assists. But rookie goalies. 17 games. Emerson backup goal is not doing that bad. But we're going to look at the rest of the league. Who's winning? Ovi has 40. McDavid, Sanye, Tyrosan, Tarasenko's not. They're not far behind. Ovi. Ovi's still beasting it up at 34 years old. Ben has 50 points. Or 50 assists. Wow, they're both number one and two. That's not what it is. Look at this. It's so tight. Phil Kessel's up there too. That cheeseburger. <clears throat> so we have to make some moves, I think. Let's see. Let's see what look what the roster looks like now. That's actually a pretty good roster. He's an eighty two now. He grew. He's growing finally. Yay. Hopefully he starts growing. <laughs> Team's like a beast. It's only this guy right here. Only three goals. He's 23 years old, but three goals. We have a good 85. We have a low person here. But if we throw him on waivers, he'll get claimed. And go tanning. We're gonna put our back. <laughs> we're putting a real goalie in. We're starting a goalie. So let's look at scouting report. Let's see what the scouting report says. We've been scouting a lot everywhere for like six weeks. Kind of scout more information. So did I find a jam out there? And these the guys are not bad. Let's look at goal tanning. We're now starting to scout goal tanning. Backup goalie second round high. Is that not bad? Holy jeez. Athletic. High. Wow. We scout him fifteen times. So I think I'm going to go back to just scouting fours and defense. <clears throat> As I think gold tanning is the weakest this year. More I want to see where was that superstar? That guy, he's like in round one, but team he plays for WHL I want to see what what he looks like in the WHL now if he's still elite or not so we're gonna go back to WHL we're gonna scout him for the next six weeks see how what he looks like see if he's still expected the two expected elite players there Wow okay Top five elite. So, ooh, and is another player. 
I'm gonna watch. See if. Wow. WHL is probably gonna give us a lot of top picks. A lot of good players maybe this year. Let's see what's on the training block now. Getting closer to the end of the season. They're looking training a prospect. They have some all first round picks up. Calgary is trying to trade a goalie and a prospect. They're still trying to trade that prospect. What do they want for him? Ooh. Ooh. See something on this. Ooh, we have no cast base. Maybe if we get a real backup goodie. No. Okay, guys, so the Corey, Corey Crawford is on the training block. The guy's still up there. Corey, Corey Crawford's still there. Uh, <clears throat> we can... Ooh, we can... Columbus is going all in. Columbus won. They want a starting goalie. We have a starting goalie. We can probably get... One of those prospects, maybe. <clears throat> we can get an area forward. And trade one of our players away what they want. They want a young player. Young a goalie. Defense. We have a lot of prospects there. Uh, right, Smith. Halak's up there, ED overall. They're still trying to trade those guys away. Rick Nash up there, 3.2 million. Uh, James Neal's a devil. Burnsy! Yo, what the fuck? Yo, what? They're going, they're rebuilding. So if they trade Burns, they can rebuild. Hmm. And I have Patch at Palangelo. Angelo. <coughs> stack, their de stack their defense for the playoffs. Get a Stanley Cup champion. Oh, this is what we're going to... We're making a trade right now. I think this is what we're going to do. But he has the next four years. I don't know if this is going to work. <clears throat> but let's try. Swap goalies. But put... Say they can eat this. Should eat about 38%. Let's see. They decline that trade. That'd be a nice trade. We trade our backup goalie for their backup goalie. We got Ottawa pick. We gave our third round this year. He too, like he's such a, he looks like a good goalie. He 
Okay, well, that's what we're going to I think we're doing it. I'm going to give up a, a draft pick. But I want to see, I want something to come back with that. If I'm giving up a pick. I think I'm gonna give up. <clears throat> I want something return. I don't know if that'll work. No. Okay. Well, I'll just so much like a third round pick for. Oh, they have a lot of goalies. Wow, we have like three goalies, four goalies. Screw it. What? They won they want They won't eat the cap space. <laughs> okay, we got we have made the trade guys, we get flurry to the roster so now we have I think a steady backup goalie for us so flurry is our now new backup goalie we have him for the next four years but <clears throat> I think because just looking at the stats of flurry versus Miller is so much better for us have Flurry as a backup, I mean, he's 83 overall, <clears throat> but it's, it's the vision. Like he's his stats look so much better than it is. Like his his overrating doesn't look that bad, but he looks so good. So <clears throat> that's why we took him. We gave up a third round pick, but it doesn't really matter. We're pretty much going all in, as you can tell. <laughs> Sometimes you have to give up stuff to win so let's go look at my bird ah yes he got happy yo there we go he got happy <clears throat> we made one tr we made a good trade. So let's just kind of get closer to the deadline see where we are We got a new backup goalie So we're gonna go right to here and then let's see Okay, we lost there Okay, we lost the last two games Ah. Uh, Do we need to change our defense a little bit? See what trades look like. <clears throat> wow, they got wow. Columbus is stacking up. Vegas traded a first round pick and a twenty. Wow. Okay, doesn't make sense. Oh, that was Vegas. Oh, no, that's not Vegas. Oh, that was the Rangers. Jack Garner goes to the Islanders. No big boss blockbusters yet. <clears throat> Nothing yet.
nothing yet. Uh, I think our bottom, like our team looks good. So what we're going to do is we're going to change, let's go like that. Let's see how he does there. It's our, this guy right here. I don't know. I feel like our top two are pretty solid. Top two solid, then it goes down here, pretty solid. And then goes down here. Plus minus are pretty good, they're 10. They're not that bad. So, but... I still find that having an A77 on the, our f third defense pair is kind of weak. We do have a lot of defense we can trade away. <coughs> Let's see what I guarantee we will be able to get him. Actually, we have to give up big players. But, ah. <clears throat> what about one year left? You have to. You guys eat cast base on that. It'd be perfect. Guys, why? Oh, okay. That's it. <clears throat> Two players. Goldies. Ooh, we can give up our starting goalie in the age. How? Oh, see. You have put these guys up. Put a goalie there. And our first. So let's see. I give up a first, a goalie, <clears throat> what they want, and then prospect and and then just throw somebody going that way with cap space. Really, that's not much. That can we have 2.8? Wow, we could. <coughs> that's what they want, but look at that. We almost can get them. Wow. Let me know, guys. Let me know in the comments below. Should we make this trade right here? right now it looks like it's a pretty good trade i just have to work away around how to work the cap space issue there so let me know in the comments below should we make this trade guys and i'm out guys so let me know comments below what should we do and i'm out peace